There is nothing like having a job that you love, and one organization is helping those with disabilities reach that goal. Here to tell us about the nonprofit that connects job seekers to employers is Haley Thoman, Executive Director of Linkages. Haley, thank you so much for joining us this thank morning. Thank you for having me. So I was telling you on break, I've never heard of Linkages, so I'm sure there's a lot of people out there who haven't. So tell us what that is. We are a nonprofit organization that basically networks on behalf of the agencies in town who directly serve the job seekers with disabilities who are looking for employment. So our job is to go out there and educate them on the benefits of hiring and then share that information with the agencies. So how did this all get started? Or It sounds like a great idea. Yeah, it's really unique. So our founder is community business leader Jim Click. We were founded in 1996. He had been hiring people with disabilities and absolutely loved it probably since the early 1980s. And so he pulled together the community agency leaders and said, what do you need to get more of this happening throughout Tucson and beyond? How can we get more people with disabilities jobs? And they said, create a networker for us that's going out there and educating businesses on the benefits of hiring our job seekers and then share that information with us. So we're really unique. That's, that's our sweet spot. Definitely unique. And now, do you work directly with the agencies or the job seekers or both? How does it all work? So I would say that there are three customers involved in our work and how they can link. Um, we have the employer, and they're kind of our number one. We want to make sure they're really happy and they're getting great candidates. That way they keep sharing their leads with us. And then we have the agencies, and we really rely on them to know the job seeker. They specialize in that. And then there's the job seeker, of course, and we don't offer any direct services for them, but there are ways for them to link with us. Um, some of those ways would be going on our website and creating a profile. Employ employers can post jobs there today. Uh, job seekers, if they're sitting at home wondering, how do I get connected, where can I find a job? They can totally make a profile on our website. Um, and then the employment specialist from the agency can as well. So you're kind of like connecting all the dots. You're, right. you're making you know, a, a need and a supply. You know, both, both of them are happening. So what is new and exciting in your world of making this happen? The OFCCP, so to not make things too complicated, yeah. they set out some regulations for federal contractors. So those are businesses who do business with the government. They recently strengthened some of their requirements around hiring people with disabilities. And they've said they would like to see 7% people with disabilities in every job category. So that's not just entry level jobs, that's all the way up to the very top. So what we're doing with that information is sharing it with employers, really trying to educate them on the new regulations, and then also sharing it with the job seekers, because up until this point, they might have thought that that disability hindered them from getting the job. But if all other things are equal and they qualify just as much as everyone else, the disability might actually put them ahead because these federal contractors are really eager to hire people with disabilities. Absolutely. So then is this kind of why you, you specialize in job seekers with disabilities or, or what made it, it that be kind of your focus? I think that's the focus because it was our founder's passion. Definitely. Um, he has a heart for people with disabilities and it's all people with disabilities. It's whether it's mental health, developmental, physical, um, linkages encompasses all of that. Well, and I know we were just looking at some of the testimonials right now mm -hmm. on the screen of, you know, some of the people that are, are very um, happy with, you know, how things turned out for them and the jobs that they, they were able to get. So if somebody's on either side of this, whether it's an employer looking for mm -hmm. someone or it's someone looking for work, how do they reach out to you first? Is it the website? Is it a phone call? How can they let you know, hey, I, I want to be a part of this? So if it's an employer, they can definitely call us, reach out to us. They can also start posting jobs today on our website. If it is someone that works for an agency and they're like, wow, I never heard about this, but it seems like a great resource, they totally could call us too. If job seekers call us, we are going to try and connect them to an agency because we really believe in the work that agencies provide. And that's that help with resumes, job search, 
job application, and sometimes even on-the-job coaching, which is a huge benefit for employers to just help with that seamless transition. Um, another great thing that's coming up are the dream job fairs. So the month of October is Disability Rehabilitation Employment Awareness Month, kind of a mouthful, but there are there are job fairs for people with disabilities throughout our state. It's an amazing time to be part of our work. And so if you're an employer or a job seeker and that would be of interest to you, go to our website. We have a link to the Dream Job Fair website or it's www.dreamjobfair.org. Well, I always say just having the knowledge and know that the, some resources are available is always the first, you know, kind of uh, speed bump you have to exactly. go over. So just get exactly. the information and go from there. So thank you so much for thank telling you. us about this. This was a great resource that we have here that a lot of people didn't know about. So thank you. Thank you. And to learn more about linkages, you can call 571-8600 or log on to linkagesarizona.org.